In this video, we'll bounce the equation for FeOH3 plus HNO3, iron 3 hydroxide plus nitric acid. Let's add the atoms up. One iron, and then three applies to everything in the parentheses, so three times the one oxygen, that's three. Three times the one hydrogen, that's three. And then we have to add this one hydrogen here, so that gives us four. And you'll notice I've left this NO3 by itself. This is a polyatomic ion. It stays together. We have an NO3 here, and we have three NO3s here. So we're going to count that as just one item. It'll make balancing much, much easier. So we have one nitrate ion here on the product side, one iron, and then for our oxygens, we have just the one because we're going to need these here with the nitrate ion. Hydrogens, two, and then we have three of these NO3s, these nitrate ions, three of those. Looks like, why don't we fix the nitrates first? I like leaving oxygen and hydrogen till last. So I have three nitrate ions here and just one here. So I could put a three in front of the HNO3. Let's update the hydrogens. I have the three times the one, three there, plus one times the three, three there. That's six hydrogens. And then the nitrates, I have the one nitrate times the three. That gives me three nitrates. So I've balanced the nitrates. Let's fix the hydrogens here. That might even solve the oxygens. We have two here and six here. So if we put a coefficient of three in front of the H2O, two times three for the hydrogens, that's six. And then for the oxygens, we have one times three. And that does it. Everything's the same on both sides of the equation. So this is the balanced equation for iron three hydroxide plus nitric acid. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.